Hello there, and welcome to what will be an exciting episode, because I'm about to build my bedroom. As you can see, I've hollowed out a nice space for it here. And I'm going to go into, well, try to go into some details on why I'm building things like I'm building. As you know, I hate talking, but I'm going to do it on this one. Here we're seeing one of the lovely problems, me doing things wrong. Anyway, uh, logs. This is the window frame, same as the window frame on the other side. Why am I building it like this? Well, the general idea is support structures go on the outside, so if I was trying to hold up the roof, I'd be adding a support structure. Really generally, I could put the top one on the outside, of course, because you'd have the log laying across the top, supporting supported by the two logs underneath, but I prefer it this way. And there's me not being able to find the edges. It's a very big window. And that's good enough. This time I'm using hardened glass. Eventually I'll change the other one over for hardened glass as well, but it's only going to be this one with hardened glass at the moment. I actually left a space in the middle when I first built this. Right here. I was thinking I might have to jump through there, but I filled it in shortly after, so. That bit's pointless. Time for a bit of flooring. You see, I was thinking maybe this like pine, but no. Let's go brighter than that. Let's use some snow. Usual thing for indoors, but since it doesn't melt in torchlight, it contrasts quite nicely with this blue. So we'll have a blue carpet wall with a white edge. Still not sure what to do with that cable, but hey. Let's get the edge in here. Badly. I think the wood has a nice contrast against the uh, grey wall. Another reason why I'm doing things there. Plus, of course, white goes with grey. Quite nicely. Right, time to cut out something. Yep, that's me going to grow more blue wood. Here's one I made earlier. Right, how to get this floor laid out. The recent idea was to have it two squares of five by five. Two, three, four, five, basically. With something in the middle. Or snow. I think I changed that after a short period of time there. I don't really like it. It's almost like a feature in the centre of the room, but it's not quite in the centre of the room, really. Okay, it's centred that way, but with the window being there, the room is going to be permanently lopsided anyway. Yep, there goes the glass. And here comes the light, since it's a bit dark in this room. So it one and a half is the side of the window for a moment. Uh, it just didn't feel right in the centre, basically. Plus, I I decided to split the room into two anyway, so... Out comes the snow. Right, and the wood. Yeah, six by five. And in goes some snow. Once I've got rid of these two wall blocks. So it's almost officially separating the two halves of the room. Time for more, some more quiet time. 16 minutes, my word. Anyway, yeah, take that out. Put some wool in those. Slightly snow in there as well. And that can come out. Uh, let's go with light. This one to snow, I guess. Right, this half of the room is going to be split into two levels. I'll have the bedroom on the top half, and hmm, not a lot really on the bottom half, but hey. at some point to get more supplies of course 
right, floor goes in, well, mid-level floor goes in three, three blocks up, so basically on the top edge of the bricks. So, now I just need to make some for that. Not too many first. Went with panels because, well, half slabs seemed a bit too thick, but covers way too thin. Made a floor out of covers, it might look nice if I can see the up and the lower part at the same time, but since I can see them both at the same time, looks like it wouldn't even support anybody's weight. Yeah, my voice is going. Drink time while I fill this in. Well, I might see it at the moment, so I might as well give you some music. Do 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 do. No, really not. Anyway, <coughs> get his tongue quickly. Or not. Right, there's that. So next is. What is next? Hmm. I need a way to get up there, really. Stairs or ladder? Uh, not a lot of room for a set of stairs, so ladder, I think. No, I could have used the um, panels to make a kind of. No, not really. Ladder. Yes, you get to watch me make ladders. Since it's fairly short, sorry. Tell me I only needed three, but I have twenty-four. The ceiling up is too low. I'm going to carve that out as well. I'll take it one wider than that. Basically, we've almost got a three high ceiling below and a three high ceiling above. Oh, don't you just love those brief moments of silence? Yes. Right. I want both balls to look roughly the same. So. I like when I get asked by people, can you teach me how to build this, that and other? I'm not actually that great, but I often spend ages just like this, standing around thinking, what to do next, what to do next? Let's put a thicker edging on it, because that looks more supportive. Am I making more sticks? Oh yes, that was it. I needed a agent for this, of course. In a real world, of course, you would have an agent. You would literally climb up a bunch of stairs. But if you did somehow get onto a balcony, it would have an agent. There's basically no way you come up here to a place like this and you wouldn't have an agent on this because you're on a building site, so... Even then it probably have an agent, so... Right, that looks good enough. Although, it looks like I sported on that edge. Mm, just hanging one edge out. Maybe I should put the sport on this edge as well. Let's try that. Actually, I can't think about it. Hmm. If I put the whole block there, then it looks much better. It looks a lot better. Go back to solid blocks again. So, 
So now I take that out, put one in there. It looks like it's supported at both corners now. Me being stupid. <sighs> put one in there. And there's still the problem with this. It still looks like it's just supported at one end and just hanging heavy at the other. So how to fix that? Uh, here's one way. Although it still looks spindly, hanging almost. Better. Ideally, I'd have another support block in the other corner. Which means, of course, moving the ladder. Uh, let's move the ladder. Ladder comes out. Ladder goes back in. And support block. And what am I doing? And support block goes in. And these aren't needed anymore. There you go, much better. Supported in all four corners. And nicely done. Although, what we do with something else there as well? Let's try some corner pieces. There you go. Much better. Let's see corner steps without corner steps. That doesn't make any sense, but hey. Right. I'm going to get some more of this walling done and do another cutscene, I think, coming up. Yes, that's me saying I'm going to do these walls. Right. I decided what to do with this pipe as well. And I'm going to put it into the wall. So, just chop this out. And down a bit. Covers on the outside, and of course, I forgot to put my tip back on. And there we go. Right, 30 seconds of boringness. That may not say much because all I'm doing is doing covers up. And of course I've got to do top page as well. And back goes the blue twisty wire. What am I doing? Uh, should I cover the top one? Nah, I'll leave that clear for the moment. I may continue that wire further up the wall like that. And then, onto this wall, which I want to look like that wall. I'm digging, digging a wall away. See, this is what happens when I try to record for 16 minutes of my voice. A, it starts to break up. B, I run out of things to say. Although this wall, hmm. There's some more light in here, really. Oh, the first idea was to change the wall to look like the other two walls, or make a feature wall, but since it was totally up into here, I can be do that without affecting the look on the other side of course. So, window. Uh, too small. Too 
too small, I said. Ah, here we go. Let's take the entire wall out. And another row of bricks, of course. And oh look, we've still got the fur logs on us. More roof support, done the proper way this time. With the side support supporting the crossbeam. Uh, once again, another check. How does it look on this side? And I've grabbed some glass panes to try that out. It doesn't work, really. That's idea, really, but not really needed here. Instead, let's make it the same as the other side. Fences. There. Right. That is almost time up, so at the start of the next episode you'll get to see the finished product. Because if you really watched me building all this it would take like, I think about 2-3 hours it took me. So in the next episode you'll get to see the finished project. It's got a nice view though. I can easily see myself relaxing in here. I shall see you then, I guess. Bye for now.